Hello from Tokyo. Today I am painting in the evening, so I'm using my ring light. So I apologize if it looks a little bit different to the usual natural lighting. However, it's a cool painting. I'm going to do a gray base and then I'm going to do a swipe. And today I'll be using a pearl color. It will be Amsterdam's Pearl Violet, this one here. It has around three or four drops of silicone oil, so has the light gold. It's quite an old light gold that I have left over. I'm going to use primary magenta, a customized pearl pink. There's a light gray for the base. And this is a kind of graphite color that I've made with black, oxide black and pearl white. And then that is the swipe color there. And then up there in the corner, you can't see it, but that's actually um, bronze. So there's the light gold. And then I'm going to first put down the light gray base and then add the colors and then swipe with the pearl violet. So let's lay down the base color. After popping all the air bubbles with a torch, then it's time to put those colors down. I'm going to start with the darkest, which is the graphite, because I'm hoping that the violet will dry and show more on that color. So you won't see it when I do the first swipe, but you will when it dries. That's, I think, the exciting part of using these Amsterdam Pearl colors. I know it looks like I'm just putting this down randomly, but I am actually being strategic because I want the gold and the bronze to show up on the edges as well, uh, but we'll see how it goes. Now that the palette knife is loaded with the swipe color, it's time to do the first swipe. So I'm going to do a second swipe before I start playing around with the design and I'll be fixing the design by blowing out the sides. So first let's do the second swipe. For this painting, I decided to first do extra swipes on the edges before blowing it out. But this actually worked out really cool when it dried because it encouraged that pearl violet to shine more on the graphite. I'm going to start playing around now by blowing bits out and I will tweak a bit with my fingers as well to try and soften some of the edges. I like to create these sort of wispy edges where the lacing is because it reminds me of Japanese traditional washi paper, which I like very much. So that's what I'm going to do. And I will talk to you when we have a look at the wet version of the finished painting.
let's have a look at the finished version the wet version of the finished painting i love how this has worked out you can already start seeing the violet the pearl violet coming through i'm going to tweak that magenta bit there on the like up the top because it looks like a face so i'm going to just play around with that a bit um and but look at the shine you can also see that pearl pink is really shining so that's going to be nice when it dries but can you see where i've broken it up with my fingers as well to make it wispy this is really cool i'm liking it and here is the dried version of the finished painting. I've cleaned it a bit with, this is like the equivalent of window lean, window cleaner. Um, I just add it to a paper towel and then brush it over. So I've just done it once. I haven't finished completely, but that is taking off a lot of the silicone. You can see that shine, especially from the customized pearl pink, but let's go in for a closer look i think it's beautiful i love all the lacing i love this color combination it's really cool isn't that good over the graphite it worked out really well with that pearl violet so i think that's a good color combination really liking the bronze as well here Using silicone oil specifically for this kind of swipe creates a reptile skin type texture, which I really like because I am trying to go for the dragon for these swipe paintings because it is the year of the dragon, 2024. I'm quite obsessed with that shine, as you can see here. So it looks really good against that gray as well. I'm going to take this to near the window so you can have a better view of it in sunlight. But honestly, that iridescent white by Liquitex, mix it with any color and it like shines like mad. I really recommend it if you want this effect. Can you see the shine as you move around? And also the pearl violet comes out a lot stronger from this lighting. Um, I'm just gonna show you some different orientations. Sorry, my hair got in there. Um, but let's have a look at it different ways. It does work landscape as well, I think, but my favorite is to have it upright and vertical. What did you think about swiping in Amsterdam's Pearl Violet? Would you try it too? Well, next time I am going to swipe with Pearl Green. So thank you so much for watching today and see you in the next one. Bye.